Eiffel. London, 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 London. Eiffel. This is Kugan Cassius for from London. We're at the Manchester Arena here for Hassan and Sinchenko. On the undercard, Gary Buckland's just defeated Stephen Foster Jr. Um, Gary, Stephen Foster Jr. not coming out for the ninth round, retiring on his stall at the end of the eighth. Uh, what are your thoughts on the fight, mate? Um, yeah, I think it was, a, it was a clash of styles. Two of us wanted to go forward and we were just clashing and holding and trying to work inside. Um, I was waiting for the late stoppage. I was going to open up late on, and, but it came early, so I'm, I'm, I'm chuffed with that. It seemed to be panning out into a good fight. Um, obviously, Stephen Foster Jr. had a cut to the top of his head, which obviously played some part in that. Yeah, it did play a part in it. You know, we had a clash of heads. I thought I was going to come worse off as it caught me here. Yeah. But hopefully and luckily, it caught him, him in the right place and job done, really. So what's next for you, obviously? You know, you still you, you retained your British super weight, super weight title. What's next for you, Gary? Well, the next is now I've a defender one more time and went out right. Or I'm number one challenger for the European, so... Whatever, whatever comes next, it's at the Richard Poxton with Vatten Promotions. But overall, you're pleased with your display well, today? Well, I'm over the moon with the performance. He's never been stopped before, and I'm the first one to stop him, so that's a great, great performance, I think. Right, well, Gary, can you give us a prediction for Ricky Hatton's comeback tonight against Sinchenko? Uh, yeah, I think he's going to do well. It's going to be over points or a stoppage, I think. All right, Gary, thank you very much for talking to us.